Welcome to Beaded Doilies by Shell. Um, in this video, I am just going to be showing you some ideas that I've come up through during the week. Um, I haven't been feeling as well, so but I didn't want to not show you these ideas. So um, first, I wanted, or I went to Walmart and bought some beading supplies for kids because when I did the headbands for my daughter, I thought that the elastic idea would be great for bracelets for kids to just slip on their hands and not have to worry about clasps. So I wanted to see what kits made available for kids and also um, it gives an age range which is six plus. Um, of course, it depends on each child. Um, if you know that the child is not going to always constantly pull on the bracelet and stuff, you know that they'll probably be good with the bracelet. Um, I noticed in this particular kit that they just combined all the beads together and didn't separate out the colors. So that gave me the idea of using different size beads instead of different color beads. Now the only pattern that I find this works well with is my teeny tiny doily double zero and it's this first one here and how you would do it is your um, one size bead would be your design bead and the other size bead would be your background bead. And I usually use the larger bead for the design and the smaller bead for the background. And as you can see, here's one with two different uh, sizes. And here's another one um, with two different sizes. And then this one here, they all look about the same size. But if you can see carefully, these um, design beads are more diamond shaped. And the ones I use for background are more rounded. Um, so these are ideas that you can use with the teeny tiny doily double zero and this um, design here. And you can make bracelets using the elastic cord. And then the kids can just slip it on and no worries of it falling off or losing or breaking clasps. Now, to determine size, you'll want to measure the wrist, so you know that's the smallest you want to make the bracelet. And then you want to measure around the hand, and that's the largest, and that way you know it won't slip off, and it won't be too tight around the wrist. Um, and then they'll have the fun of having a nice bracelet that they can just slip on and off anytime they want to. Now the other collection I got had letter beads in them. Now this collection was nicely organized by color, but the way they had put the plastic on, when you tried to take it off it was very difficult. And the beads would go popping out all over the place. So I don't recommend these kits. Um, I got them because I wanted to see what was made available for kids and also to get an idea of age range. Um, that also gave me the idea of the elastic cord because they all came with elastic cord. But you can buy that separately as well as all the different beads. And with the letter beads, I came up with the idea of writing out messages. And here we have hold fast to dreams. So that led me to make this pattern here, which is teeny tiny doily double, a, double zero A. And in this one you would use um, words that are five letters or smaller. And in this one, you would use words that are 15 letters or smaller. And as you can see, hold was four, so it's in the center. Same with fast. Two is only 
two letters, so it's in the center. But dreams is six, so it is on the outside of the doily. And here is an example of how I did it. I wrote in hold, and then I colored in the side so that I knew this one was not part of the letters, but part of the background now. Same with fast. And then two, I wrote in the two, and then colored in the other three. And then here's dreams. I decided where I wanted it, and then I colored in the other one so I would know those are now background colors. And that is one way you can make a nice little message bracelet, or um, it can be a sun catcher, or anything else that you might want to create. And these are just some ideas that I came up with over the week, and I wanted to share them with you. Um, I'm going to be putting up this pattern here, this new pattern for the teeny for the letters at my different um, web pages and I hope that you will enjoy them and make lots of wonderful bracelets and you can even use it in headbands um, a nice headband would be cool with this too a uh, keychain anything that you can imagine and I hope that you enjoy making stuff and have a nice day